a ship left point P here and sailed due east due east for 90 hours at an average speed of 24 knots to point R. I calculate the distance between P and R. The distance between P and R, we have been given the, the speed and the time. But we know distance is equal to, uh, this distance in nautical miles will be speed times time. Speed is 24 knots times time 90 hours. And that one will give us 2160 nautical miles. So calculate the distance in kilometers per hour, uh, kilometers, distance in kilometers. We have now nautical miles, but we know one nautical mile from here is equal to 1.853 kilometers, 216 nautical miles will be what? This 2160 times 1.853. That one is 4,248 kilometers. Determine the position of R. The position of R. So to get the position of R first, we get the angle difference. Angle difference. So we have a point R, we don't know where it is, but we have the distance in nautical miles. We have, we know the formula, and this one is automatically a small circle. Because the latitude, the latitude here is 10, so it is a small circle. So you know how to get the distance of a small circle. So distance of a small circle is given by 60 times angle difference alpha cos theta. This is the latitude theta, the latitude angle, latitude angle. Now distance is in, we have in nautical miles 2160 is equal to 60 times the angle difference cos 10 because our latitude is, the, what they are sharing is the, the latitude because it is going along the same latitude to the east. So, so if I can that is this is the equator so this 10 is here. So this point P is here and the Q, uh, R is here. Now, what they are sharing is this 10. You're moving from here up to here, so they are on the same latitude. What is changing is the, is the long longitude. That's what is changing. So this one will be equal to, so theta, uh, alpha will be equal to 216, you divide by 60 times cos 10. So theta is equal to 36.56 degrees. So the angle difference is this one. Now, we are moving from P to the east. And we are going east. So if it is to the east, it means they are on the same side. They were on the same side. Eh? So what they, what happened is that to get the right, the longitude of R, it is thirty six point fifty six plus forty, which is equal to seventy six point fifty six degrees. Kwanini tumefanya sababu P ko east. So nana P ko east na ime move towards east. So inaenda to the east. So we add. So now R will be 10 degrees south, comma, 76, 56 degrees east. Find the local time to the nearest minute at a point R when the time of P is 11. So local time. So now we have R. We have the time at R. Uh, find the at a point. Uh, find the local time to the next minute at point R when the time at P is 11. So P, it is 11. 
and it is moving towards r so to the east to the east we are going to add the time the, the time uh -huh. so first let us get the angle difference angle difference now we know the latitude the uh, latitude at the longitude at um, at r remember for time we only use the wrong tubes now p p is 30 degrees south 40 east r is 10 degrees south 76 56 degrees east so east is that is the wrong to do we have so what we are doing now we are getting the angle difference which is 76.56 minus 40 and that one will give us 36.56 degrees but we know that one minute one degree is equal to four minutes 36.56 will be how many minutes so it is 36 Point fifty six times four. This one will give us one forty six point twenty four minutes. This one is the same as two hours twenty six minutes. So up IQ eleven to the east we are going to add because we are going to the east. We add it equal east east yes, like we are moving towards east. So we will add. So it is eleven point zero zero to 26 6 to 13 so it affects palace sa saba na 26 pm sa saba na 26 pm if you move if point r is equal to the west to get the time here at this point we subtract so come up with 11 we are going to subtract when you move to the along the same uh, latitude for a different longitude to the west, we are going to subtract. 